Happy New Year to everyone and welcome to 2014. We're so excited for this year, it promises to be one of the best years yet and we're just going to dive right into the webinars starting with one on our website. All right, so this is our landing page. It's the new website. We're so excited about it. We're no longer using .co.za. We're now using .com, so we're using the global website, and you'll be redirected anyway if you go to .co.za. It looks brilliant. We're so proud of our development team for what they've come up with, and we're super excited to introduce this whole thing to you. A lot of you are already well acquainted with it. This video is just for those who might not have come back on holiday as early as we did from holiday. This video is for those who might not have come back from holiday as early as we did and you just need a little um, tour of the website. All right, So from here you'll be able to do so much more than you could on our old website and we're just going to jump right into um, all of that. All right, so on the landing page, you'll be able to open a live account, a demo account. You'll be able to become a partner whether you're an affiliate or an IP. All right, an IP is an introducing partner. If you want to know more about affiliates and IPs, you can always send an email to us or you can click on the We Are Online option here because we still have live chat active on our website. So if you have any questions while you're on, you can just click on that, put your name, your email address, and then you can just drop us a, a mail or I mean, send us an, uh, an IM there and we'll be able to assist you as soon as possible. So you can just put your name and email in there and then you just type your message in IMS and we will get back to you right there and we'll be able to assist you whatever you need help with. All right. So that's our home page. Now we have on the site available as well Forex Central. All right. Forex Central is a All right. So that's the landing page. If you to zoom right down, you'll be able to see all the platforms that we have and if you go and click on view platforms you'll be able to download MT4 you'll be able to access web trader you'll be able to see the auto trading forthcoming attraction that we have um, it's not active yet but as soon as it is we'll let you all know at the bottom here you'll be able to see another link for you to see Forex Central so it gives you a little bit more about what Forex Central is all about alright so you see we have the support um, side of it we have the webinar aspect and we have tools so under tools you'll be able to find different calculators and converters and then under webinars you'll be able to find all the webinars that we've done all the YouTube uh, videos that we have and then you also find under support you have different forex with answers to all your queries alright if you look a little bit further down you'll find our newest members and our testimonials um, from all our, our amazing clients that we, we really um, appreciate. All right. So right at the top you have your help desk, okay? And you have your access to web trader right there, and then you have the gold lounge, which is sitting where the members area used to sit. Okay? So we're just gonna jump over to Forex Central. All right. Once that page loads, there we go. We're just gonna go right to the bottom and then it shows us where to start. So you'll find that we have a frequently asked question section here at the end, all right, or at the far right. That one's not active as yet because we're just getting all the stuff together and then we'll have all the questions up there that we usually get. So you can have your questions answered without having to go too far. And then we have all the intraday research reports. So the the market research report that you get you'll be able to get from the website now if you're not anywhere near your emails you'll also be able to get weekly um, wisdom as well as certain calculators and converters like Fibonacci calculator if you use it the margin calculator um, if, you, if you'd like to know um, how the margin is calculated and then you also have all the manuals that we previously had as well and we also have a traders compass manual as well if you haven't got the new platform on your system um, I suggest you go ahead and do that as soon as possible. Traders Compass is amazing. It gives you hints about what's going on in the markets. It tells you when your stop loss or your take profits are too wide or too tight. It, 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 it analyzes your trading um, patterns and then gives you tips on how to correct what needs to be corrected. And whenever you're trading something, it might just pop up. Like let's just say I'm trading pound. A pop-up will come up saying there's going to be an announcement about the pound tomorrow or today later on that might affect the trade that you've placed, and so it just gives a lot of hints and it tries um, and works with your with your um, way of trading 
to better your chances of making more profits. And then we also have the videos here in the self-help categories for our webinars and for different support um, facilities. All right. And so um, that's Forex Central. If you jump over to platforms, you'll see that we have all the platforms listed here. So we have MT4 where you can register for it or you can download it. So if you don't have an account, click register. If you have an account and you just need the, the software on your PC, go ahead and download it, okay? Or you can use the email that was initially sent to you. All right, then we have WebTrader as well, which you can go ahead and register for, demo or live, or you can access it because you won't be able to download it because it's not, it's web-based. So that's the point of WebTrader. And so if you want to access it, you can use, access it from there. Mobile Trader here will show you that you have a, a one in BlackBerry App World. We have one in the Apple Store, and we also have one in Google Play. Prodigy is our um, platform. ACM Go created it. All right. It's not active here um, for us just yet, but you can always inquire about it if you want to know more information. All right, and then you have the PAM accounts that are also at an inquiry stage, and then you have auto trading, which is a forthcoming attraction. Very exciting stuff. All right, so right now we're just going to go ahead and log into the Gold Lounge. All right, so the Gold Lounge being an amazing, mm, there we go. All right. So Gold Lounge, if you're if you're previously Gold Lounge, everyone should have access to Gold Lounge. Okay. At this point, everyone should have access to Gold Lounge. If you have been a client of ours from before December last year you should have had an email sent to you that allows you to register for Gold Lounge. If you don't have that, please drop me a mail and I'll help you sort that out. All the new clients, of course, have gotten the initial email. Mm, that is not on. I can't remember what the password is. And now we'll go ahead and log into Gold Lounge. Now Gold Lounge you should be able to access no problem. If, you're, if you've been a client of ours since about November last year, then you should have received an email that tells you to register for Gold Lounge. And then once you put your email address into the, the, the field there, it would send you credentials for it. All the clients who open accounts after um, December or during late December, you got the, the, the email straight uh, that will give you access to Gold Lounge. All right, so we're just going to jump over to Gold Lounge over here, and this is what Gold Lounge looks like on the inside. I love it. I think it's brilliant. Um, so this is what Gold Lounge looks like on the inside. It looks amazing. It's got a very... Um, this is what Gold Lounge looks on... <laughs> This is what Gold Lounge looks like on the inside. It looks great. Um, I love the tiles that they use. It, the whole setup is brilliant. I love the new look. This is what Gold Lounge looks like on the inside. It's got a great new look, it's, and it's very user-friendly, and everything is right there where you can see it. All right. So first of all, we're going to go to the personal info um, tab here, tile. First of all, we're going to go to the personal info tile over here and we'll see that you can edit your personal and contact details or you can change your password. So if we click there, it'll give us all the information that we signed up with, okay? So that's the information that we signed up with. You can change your phone number, but you can't change your email address simply because your email address is viewed as an ID with us. So in order for you to change your email address, you have to send us um, email support send us the, your new email address then we'll change it on this on the system because remember you need your email address to log into gold lounge so if you change it um if we if you are to be able to change it in the gold lounge it might just mess up the entire thing uh, mess up your access to gold lounge so I'm doing a video a video it might change all right so you won't be able to change your email okay 
there. So it's it has all your information that you signed up with. You can you can change your your so it has all the information you signed up with. You just won't be able to change your email address if you need that changed or updated. Let us know email support and we'll go ahead and update that on our hmm. Let's start that again. So it shows you all the information that you you are there that you emailed really. So it shows you all the information that you started. Ah, so it shows you all the information that you signed up with. You will own there that you signed. <coughs> Damn it! It shows you all the information that you signed up with. You won't be able to change your email address if you need that changed or updated. Send an email to support. We'll go ahead and update that on our end. Right at the bottom, um, you'll see that you have an option to upload your bank statement and put your banking details preemptively. All right. So if you just want us to have that for faster withdrawals, uh, when a withdrawal comes through, we know we already have your bank statement and all your banking information. You can go ahead and fill that in if there's this one bank account that you're always going to use for withdrawals. All right. Also, you might want to keep in mind that there is a three-month um, period on the bank statements that we accept for withdrawals. So as long as it's it's um, printed or produced within three months of your withdrawal, then it's still valid. Outside of that, you have to load this information again. And then you also have the option to change your password. So no longer will you need to call us and say, I can't remember my password or I lost the email, please reset my password. You just log into Gold Lounge. All right. This is for your MT4, your, your client terminal or your, your live account. You log into Gold Lounge, come to this part, choose whether you want to change your Gold Lounge password or one of your account passwords. Once you've done that, you put in your new password, you confirm it, and then you save changes. <coughs> You'll see all your accounts are listed right here. So you'll be able to see the date that you registered for your account, the oldest account, the newest account, whether it's an IP account, what balances you have in the account, and so on and so forth. All right, so that's personal information. So under open an account, you can open an additional live or demo account. So if you need to open an, an additional live account, instead of having to put up new FICA, well, if it's in the same three-month period, if you, without having to put in new FICA and put all your, your information in and, and create all these uh, and fill in all, the whole form, you can just go ahead and open an additional one here. It'll just ask you for a password if you want. You can see, use the same password as your other live account and you'll be able to access it no problem. It'll make it um, opening additional accounts quick and easy. Here you have an open additional account option where you can open an additional live or demo account. So if you click on that, you'll be able to open an extra live account if you need one. All right. It won't give you the whole form to fill. All you have to do is just put in um, a leverage uh, there. So here you can open an additional account. All right. So here you just choose what type of account you need, and then you create a password. You agree to the terms and conditions. You click open new account, and voila, you've got a new account, and you don't have to fill in the entire form again. Here you'll be able to make your withdrawals quickly and easily. All right. If we click on the withdrawal request form, I just need to go, go through the. Just need to go through a few things with you. Mm, nice. Now you can with okay. This is not on. Okay, let's do this. Here now you have your withdrawal funds. Here you have your withdraw funds option. All right. So if you hover over that, it'll show you that you can actually withdraw funds quickly and easily. And I just need to go through the form with you so that we can get a few things sorted. Mm -hmm. I did that preemptively. And here you can withdraw your funds. I'm going to go through the request form with you so that you can find, you can, ah. No, why am I dribbling? And here you can withdraw funds quickly and easily. I'm going to do, what? And uh, no, oh my goodness. And here you'll be able to withdraw funds quickly and easily. I'm going to do, go through the withdrawal. And here you can withdraw funds quickly and easily. I'm going to go through the withdrawal request form with you just to clarify a few things. All right.
So here, once you've um, come to the withdrawal request form, it'll ask you which account you want to withdraw from. So you don't have to type in your account number manually because sometimes you might make a mistake and you might put in the wrong account number and then that delays your withdrawal. So here it gives you specific accounts that you can withdraw from. So even your IP withdrawal requests can be done from here. You, you decide what currency and what amount that you want, all right, from here, all right. You put your information in there. So once you choose an account, so here you, you can go ahead and select the account from which you want to make a withdrawal, and here you don't have to type your information in anymore. Once you've selected the account, it fills in all the information at the bottom, all right. You put in the amount that you'd like to withdraw, let's just say, and then you go down. Account name title, that is your account name, all right, the account holder's name, okay. All right. Amount. All right, so it has all your information saved there. And then under account name, you're going to put the account holder's name. So that's your bank account name, the name that you signed your bank, your bank account, the name that, huh. That's your bank account holder's name, all right? So that would be the name that you use at the bank. Next to that would be the bank, um, whether you're with FNB or West Bank or Barclays or Standard, all right? And then you put in your bank account number, you put in your branch code next, so you'll see that there's SWIFT BIC sort code. Since we're, we're local, um, South African clients will only need to put in their branch codes, all right? And then international clients would use um, one or the others. And then you have your bank branch address. And then you have your, your branch address where you can just say FNB Four Ways or Standard Bank, um, Bedford View or, or whatever, you, wherever you stay. So there's just your branch address where it would be FNB Four Ways or, or Standard Bank, Santon, something like that. All right, then you put in the city where you are, then if there's a special instruction that you'd like to add, you can go ahead and put that in. Then you can upload your bank statement directly there, all right? All right, that might, um, that we're still working on. And so you can upload your bank statements right onto the system from there. Once you click confirm, your bank statement and your withdrawal request will be sent right through to us. Here you can also deposit funds, all right, using credit card, using an EFT, all right, so you have your on online credit card payment option, and then you can also see our banking details so that you can go ahead and do an EFT through your internet banking, otherwise you can do an online instant EFT that takes about 24 hours. If you have vouchers, um, if we're running vouchers, you'll be able to fund uh, your vouchers from there, and then if you've already made your cash payment, or you just want to follow up with a certain payment, you can upload your proof of payment there. You also have access to really cool downloads, wallpapers, tools, you can even down the download the platform from there. All right. So here you have different wallpapers, I think they're awesome. I, I have a few of them saved on my PC, and then you also have access to download the platforms from there. You'll also be able to see that we do have different platform options, um, Android, Apple, Windows, Blackberry, MT4 itself, and Symbian. Here you'll also be able to see your account history for your closed trades. Here you'll also be able to see your account history for your closed trades. So if you'd like to look at your history, maybe you want to refer to a certain trade, you can quickly look in there and then you can choose the date from which um, you'd like to. So that's all. Here you also have another um, portal for you to uh, access Forex Central. So if you want to use one of the calculators, if you want to look at the intraday research reports, or if you want to use one of the converters, you can go ahead and access it there if you want to look at the webinars as well. Here you can transfer money from one 
account to another. This only works if the accounts are in the same name. So if you've got two live accounts, you can transfer funds from one live account to the other. We still won't be able to transfer an account from a sister to a brother, from a husband to a wife, from a friend to a friend. It has to be the same account holder name on both accounts. Here we also have quick access to the research report. If you want to know what the research report says for today, you just click on there and it will bring up the research report on, on, in web view. And it will bring up the research report <clears throat> and it will bring up the research report and it will and it will bring up the research report in web view. If you're an IP, then this is the partners area for you. Alright, so So once you click on the partners area, you'll see an option for you to become a partner. That is not yet active. We are going to have that active um, in no time, as well as become an affiliate. But if you're already a partner, then you can just click on My Traders and to be able to show you all the traders and the, all the activity that they've had, like the, 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 the rebates that you, the commission that you, you've, you've accumulated so far, um, the, which ones are active, which ones are inactive, and you'll be able to get a better picture of which clients need your attention the most. The promotion material is also going to be available soon. Right now, it's also forthcoming. That's basically Gold Lounge. It looks awesome. Really happy about it. Um, and let us know if you have any issues. So that is Gold Lounge. So that is Gold Lounge. It's brilliant. I love it. Let us know what you think about it. Let us know if there's something else that you'd like to see in Gold Lounge. Let us know if there, if there, if you're having any issues with anything in Gold Lounge, and we'll quickly and swiftly assist you. Thank you so much for your time and.